joined the Marine Corps because I said it, I thought it was the best thing I could have done. You know, I just want to do something different. I want to help my country, and I think I'm doing. It. I don't think about you know, wow, I'm a corporal in charge of a whole bunch of people. I'm just a Marine surrounded by a bunch of other Marines trying to make the best out of the situation. I think about when I go out, it's just another day. Try and make it through to the next one. Uh, it's not, it's nothing tough, it's nothing hard. It's just, just another day here in Iraq. It's a uh, definitely a different situation. If you're more family oriented and you, family is your main thing, it's, it'd be hard for you out here being so far away. But as long as you don't think about it, do your job, and, and th uh, days go by pretty quick. I love it. This is, this is like, it's not every day you can come out here and do what I do as a, as a sergeant, barely promoted, and be in charge of all these bits, in charge of all these trucks, in charge of teaching our, teaching our actors how to do things. Showers, probably get to shower once every four days. Uh, we get to go, go back to uh, Camp Korean Village, get to take a shower there. They got running water all the time. Uh, chow, we get two hot meals a day. We eat MREs for lunch. If we're lucky, we'll make it back for chow. If you're scared, it's, yeah, you're, you're also scared, but you also trust, trust in the guys with the truck with you. You trust your, uh, your gunner, you trust your driver, you trust your VC, your VC, you trust all the guys in the truck with you, and the truck guys in the truck ahead of you and behind you. So it is, you're scared, but you also you trust the people with you, so you're not as scared. And all you see is the desert. Um, certain places change a lot. Uh, for the better, yes. Uh, some places, it's been rough, but it's getting there. Um, it depends on our record. The Iraqi people, you know, it, it depends on them. If they want their country to be better and prosperous and change to, you know, better good, then that's on them. We're doing the best we can to help them out, you know. We're not here to babysit them. We're here to teach them and help them and liberate this country, you know. Let's get, them, get this country off their feet and make it better for themselves. We are in the middle of nowhere, but we're set up pretty, pretty good. The fob's nice. We've got plenty of chow. And uh, the Iraqis you know, give us, every time we go out there, we have lunch or dinner with them. And very good food and very, very hospitable. I think the last thing that happened was probably about three or four months ago. So everything, uh, the client's been looking a lot better in the, the future here. Everything should be getting better. Not that bad here. I can't complain because I've been here. It's my third time out here, so I can't complain. Um, I know what it's like, and yeah, it could be worse. Iraq's not as bad as they say. Yeah, you know, just come out and do your job.